Okay, friends, today we will solve some question about resistance. Practice 7D. A 1.5 volt battery potential is given. It is connected to a small light bulb with a resistance of 3.5 watt in the current. That shall be given. That shall be is 1.5. That shall be is 1.5 volt. And then the resistance is given. 3.5 ohm. And what is wanted? What is the current it says in the circuit? The current is equal to plus. Okay, current is half ohm slow. So you remember it, delta V over R. And I is equal to delta V is given 1.5 volt divided by 3.5 Ohm. And then the current through the battery, or that the battery produces, it will be 0 0.43 ampere. Let's see another question. D2, a stereo with a resistance of 120 ohm it is connected to a potential difference of 220 volt. What is the current? It says uh, again the resistance is given. The resistance R is equal to 120 ohm, and then delta V is given. Potential of the battery is 220 volt. It says what is the current through the stereo? And same as the first question, I is equal to delta V over R. I is equal to delta V is 220 volt divided by R it is 120 ohm. Then the current will be 1.83 ampere. This is the second question. And the third one says these are easy and don't, I don't focus on them. Good one. Find the current in the following devices when they are connected across a potential difference of 220 volt. Now we have a constant potential. We have a constant potential 220 volt. And in each section, I want it. It says find the current I. Let's say A first. Find the current I. If the, if the resistance of 80 ohm, a hot plate, it says connected. If a resistor of 88 ohm is connected to that potential. And B, it says again calculate the current. If uh, a 36 ohm connected to that potential. So in each I wanted A. I is equal to delta V over R. Here I will say R1 because for section A it's better to say R1 and R2 because R change for each case. Then I is equal to potential 220 divided by R1 88 ohm. 220 volt 88 ohm. Then I will be 2.5 ampere. 2.5 B. Uh, it says calculate the current if a microwave oven, 36 ohm microwave oven connected to that potential. So again, I want it, delta V over R. Now R2, it is microwave oven. I is equal to then 220 volt divided by 36 ohm resistor. Then current for second key will be around 6.1 ampere. That is second uh, third question. Let's see the fourth one. Uh, the current in the microwave oven 6.25 ampere. I given now 6.25 ampere. 
if the resistance of this oven is 17.6 R is given 17.6 ohm what is the potential difference across the oven delta V one remember on stone delta V is equal to I multiplied by R it is and it is equal to delta V wanted, delta V is equal to I given 6.25 ampere multiply 17.6 ohm. When we multiply them, delta V will be around 110 volt. Or we can write it as delta V is equal to 1.1 10 to the power of 2 volt also possible. Five. A typical color television draws 2.5 ampere current. I is given 2.5. When connected across a potential of 220, if that power is 220 volt, TV draws 2.5 ampere. What is the effective resistance of the television? R1. According to the, uh, here it says effective Y, it says effective friends. And the ventilation television warm up, then the resistor can change and there will be some change. Not much, but in resistance. So effective means a constant resistance wanted. So R is equal to delta V over I. If you remember, Ohm says delta V over I is constant. That's called also on slope, it is equal to R. R is equal to delta V is 220 volt divided by I, it is 2.5 ampere. Then when we divide it, we will see that R is equal to around 88 ohm. That is the resistance, effective resistance of TV. Six. The current in a certain resistor is 0 0.5 ampere. Whereas the I is given 0 0.5 ampere. When it is connected to a potential of 110, delta V is equal to 110 volt. What is the current if the same resistor? Okay. What is I? If the same resistor is connected to 90 volt, delta V is equal to 90 volt. And B, what will be I if the same resistor is connected to a potential of 130 volt? In A and B, V given, I want it. And in the upper part, I and delta V given. In order to calculate current in each section, we need R. So by using those, let's calculate R. R is equal to, firstly, R is equal to delta V over I. And it is equal to 110 divided by 0 0.5. Uh, 110 volts, 0 0.5 ampere. And if you divide it, you will get R as 220 uh, ohm 220 ohm we get R but R not wanted as we see here I wanted the first one section A let's say I1 is equal to delta V1 over R it is equal to V190 90 divided by 220. Then I1 for the first section A, it will be 0 0.41, 0 0.41 ampere. 
for section B, since pattern should change, current force are the same, so I will say I'm Q, then for B2 over R, R is same. So it is equal to uh, 130 divided by 220. And if you divide it and use your calculation, you will get I to as 0 0.5900. Thank you. That's all.